Hey guys, this is Jen Greenberg. I wanted to make a video about who makes a good coach. One of the questions that I get asked a lot is, I would love to be a coach, I would love to do what you do, but I just don't think I could do it. I just don't think that I have what it takes to make a difference in the lives of others. So let me just give you a brief overview of what a good coach is. So first of all, let me say a few things that a coach is not. We are not fitness professionals. We are not nutritionists or dietitians. Uh, we are not personal trainers. We're not group exercise instructors. We are people that are encouraging others. We are people that are leading by example, by being on our own health and fitness journey, sharing it with other people, our friends, family, social media networks, whatever, and we are sharing what we're doing, sharing what is working, and inspiring others to do the same. So you do not have to be a professional. You don't have to have your goal body. You don't have to have six-pack abs. You don't have to have it all figured out. All you need to have is desire. You need to have the desire to be on a fitness journey and the desire to help other people along the way. If you think that you need to be perfect and that you have to have that goal body, you have to have lost your baby weight, that is not the case at all. In fact, the more perfect you are, the more unrelatable you can be. So when you lead with perfection and you have this idea that you have to be perfect, that's where you actually lose connection with your network, with your friends and family. So this is what I want you to take away from this video. If you have the desire to be healthy and live a healthy lifestyle and improve yourself in areas like nutrition, exercise, learning new things, learning new skills, and you have the desire to influence and inspire others to become healthy, then you have what it takes to be a good coach. So don't let limiting beliefs get in your way of something that could be so awesome in your life. So I hope that helps and I hope that answers some of your questions about what it takes to be a good coach. Um, if you have any questions, post below and I would love to answer them. Thanks guys!